Welcome to the video on the digital lifestyle.com. In this video, we're going to have a quick look at the Acer C720 Chromebook. Now, last year I looked at the Acer C7 Chromebook, and this is kind of the up to date version of that. So, uh, we're going to take a look, unbox it, and um, put it through its paces. So, in the box, you've got the C7 and the charger. And that's about it, really. So here we have the, the C7. Now, to give you an idea on size, here is my 11 inch surface. So it's slightly smaller, and my um, MacBook Air. Down the way. There is it with my MacBook Air. So on the side here, we've got um, USB 3. It's got the Haswell chip in this device, that's what we've got USB. P3, HDMI, uh, full size HDMI port as well, power, headphone or headset, so you can put the microphone and think combination device in there, full size SD card reader, another USB port, and a Kensington lock. And that's it for the ports. Right, so let's just, uh, so it's running Chrome OS, which is essentially a Chrome browser. Uh, let's see what else I can tell you about this over the C7. Um, on the C7, I was getting uh, five, ba five hours battery life. On this, I've been getting about six and a half hours, I should say about eight hours. Uh, the Haswell chip in there um, should give you that extra performance in there. It was about four hours on the old one, so that's a, a good improvement. And it does actually feel a lot quicker. And I think part of the reason for that is it's got a 16 gig SSD drive in there instead of the uh, spinning disk, a 500 gig spinning disk. So that makes it feel a lot snappier when you're loading uh, browser windows it opens a lot quicker everything feels very snappy on there so I think that is a definite benefit over the old one there's 2 gig of RAM which I think is probably okay unless you're opening a ton of tabs and the screen is running 1366 by 768 so you're not in the real high res um, category but it's a nice screen it's actually not too reflective as well so you're probably outdoor pretty pretty good for outdoors as well um, so what can tell about the keyboard it's got the island style keyboard fairly standard it does feel a little bit plasticky uh, but the keys are okay you've got um, a trackpad which has um, multi-touch for scrolling or two fingers scrolling which are which are quite like um, the click bits of it do feel a little bit on the um, sort of plasticky as well. I mean, the whole build is plasticky, I mean, there's no doubt about that. £199 retail price, so that's pretty much what you'd expect. Um, like I said, on the performance side of it, it's pretty snappy. It's just a web browser, so uh, you can read more about uh, Chrome OS from various sources on the internet and look at our C7 video for uh, where I looked a bit more at Chrome. Uh, you've got Chrome apps in there. Uh, let's, I'm just going to open a lot of tabs. You don't even have to open them as tabs, really. You can use them just through the through this. And there's things like Google Docs on here, um, which you can use for sort of spreadsheets and um, word processing and whatever. We've got stereo speakers here underneath, but because of the feet, it doesn't block out the sound too much when you're going down. And yeah, the speakers are a bit on the tinny side, but they work quite nice. Um, volume's not too bad. Let's see if we can increase that. Press maximum volume. Not too bad. Now, what else can we show you on here? Uh, we've got Wi Fi. So what else can I show you in here? We've got Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, um, Wi-Fi works on 5 gigahertz range as well. So really there's not a lot to say about this uh, with it being a Chromebook. It's fairly basic. It runs Google Chrome, which Chrome OS, which is essentially a web browser, the Chrome browser. If you use a Chrome browser, then you're going to be fairly familiar with the uh, the environment on this. 
If all you if you need something a bit more powerful, you want to do photo editing, movie editing, music editing, it's going to be a bit tricky on this unless you can get uh, a Chrome app, which is essentially a web-based apps to do it. So you pretty much know whether this is the right thing for you. Is if you live in the Chrome browser and you don't need a lot of else, then this is okay. 199 pound. There's no OS install. You don't really have to do updates or anything like that. It just it just works. Perhaps good for giving it to uh, one of the kids that want to play around with it. Uh, I did look at it for my kids, but they preferred having the uh, the Surface uh, because it did a bit more. They've got the App Store and everything else, and that was like 250 for the uh, Surface RT. So anyway, that's the uh, Chromebook Acer C720, and uh, you can compare that with the C7 video and look a bit more about Chrome on that. Thanks for watching this video. And I'll see you in another one. Bye.